Good opportunity to be able to have some nice, safe pressure, to be able to put them under pressure, let them be able to succeed. Um, and if they, if they happen to not make that putt or happen to not make that chip or happen to not make that drive, it's okay. It's not the end of the world. They can be able to go on and get it the next time, learn from it. And so we're very proud as Joe Dickey Electric to be sponsors of the greatest golf. If you're like me, and maybe you've been waiting, waiting on a sign you're doing right. If you're like me, and maybe you've been chasing, chasing down a question all this time. But maybe what I'm really after ain't so far away. In fact, I feel a pull from where I came. I'm coming home I want to go Back to where I lift my heart and soul I'm coming home I want to know What it's like to rest this rolling storm If you're like me then maybe you've been fighting Fighting with the reasons you've been if you're like me, and maybe you've been riding, riding off your chances on this road. But lately I've been doubting its direction anyway. In fact, I feel a pull from where I can. I'm coming home. Introduce yourself, talk to me about your career in junior golf. Um, I'm Leah Benson. Hi, I'm Jane Bernard. Hi, I'm Luke Geister. My name is Nicholas Beistel. Hi, I'm Michael Porter. Hi, I'm Bryce Daggett. Hi, I'm Zoe Stern. Hi, I'm Caitlin Hoover. Hello, I'm, my name is Tyler Anderson. Hi, I'm Alexander Eckstein. I'm Sophia Yurich from Poland Seminary. I Hi, I'm Luke Nord. I'm coming home. No. Okay. It's nice to like know some new girls and just then you could become friends with them, play with them like through life. So. You no, know, I've met some pretty good guys out here and you know. Michael Porter, talk and walk to me, buddy. Hey, tough fight all day. Yeah, we were going back and forth all the way through 18, but... Crazy finish. Crazy finish. Yeah. How do you feel? I feel great. First greatest golfer win. I've been close, uh, I think, a few years, and finally got one this year. It breaks some barriers. Like, I only won, started winning, like, last week. I won, I think, two tournaments, and before that, I, like, couldn't get it done, so... It's giving me con confidence going into the season, like... I'm glad you guys were able to have the tor tournaments too with like the whole COVID thing. Like it really helped because there weren't a lot of tournaments other than the real big ones that you could play. Like in those, like it's really hard to get first and gain confidence in those. So I shot 76 today on a uh, hole 16. I hit it from 170 yards to two feet. I like being champion because it makes you look really good and it sounds like you are a really good golfer. Just keeping a positive mindset and not letting the bad shots get to you. I played all day until 16, and then on 17 I made a par, and then on 18 I made a par. What do the symbols mean? Is there any special? Uh, no, no, just a flower that I drew. I'm hoping I get a cool tan line from it. What's more important, a tan line or a golf score? Oh, golf score. But I mean, tan line would be a good positive, like plus. So introduce yourself, 
talk to me about your career in junior golf. I'm Luke. Project, project. Hi, I'm Luke Nord. It's a golf course, you can't. We can project a little. Uh, my name's Cameron Colbert, and I'm a senior this year. Hi, I'm Mackenzie Gustis. Hi, my name is Kate Sowers, and today I shot 38 at the... Oh, <laughs> Hi, I'm Genevieve Bell, and I'm Brittany Ajanda. Um, I remember how welcoming it was and how like good of an experience of a tournament it was. It was very fun and it gave me my first like taste of competition. So, so I'm Ken Keller. I'm going to be a senior at Youngstown State University and I'm a member of the men's golf team. I'm also a member of the golf team. I'm Brian Cordupo and I'll be a junior this year. I uh, sweat out a qualifier with, uh, with you actually at Mill Creek when I was, um, I think I was 15 and I was waiting on the 18th hole to see if someone made a putt to go into a playoff or not. I think I was 13. You know, that was the that was the year that I got the win. So I guess that would be my most you know most memorable moment with it. All right, All right. tee box on so, number so, 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 16. So, 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 okay. And go. On the tee box at number 16, got up, hit my driver, absolutely pured it down the fairway. Why shouldn't I? Because yeah. I shot 96. <laughs> uh, hi, I'm Caden Sykes, and uh, Todd asked me to talk about my hat and hair choice. And I had a lot of points though, so I knew I was going to be in, not to be so cocky. How important in golf is the right pair of sunglasses? Very important. It helps with depth reception and it helps you find the golf ball better and everything. It also gives you a certain mystique. How, yeah, you how don't important. know where my eyes are right now, so that's that helps. I'm Alyssa Rapp. I don't know. Can you show us the full hair? Uh, okay, but it's pretty messy, you know. Oh, yeah, there it is. Look at it go. Give it a three, four, six, the four, three sixty view right there. Hi, I'm Alyssa Rapp. I'll be an eighth grader at Mooney High School. No, no, no. It stays lit all day. Yeah, it stays lit all day. I'm Sad. Alyssa Rapp. I'll be a junior at Mooney Cardinal, Cardinal Mooney High School. You know, I got to keep my head up. So that's about it, man. I mean, congratulations to Michael. He deserves it. Uh, this is the last time I'll ever play, so that was my last walk down, and I'm glad I was able to make a little suspense out of it. Great win. It's been a long time coming. I love it. I love it. Todd and I were talking throughout the process of trying to get this whole thing to go with COVID, with the closing of the Vindicator, with all the, all the strikes against them. I'm really proud of the fact that Greatest Golfer has been able to happen. Uh, it's able to been kind of a, it's a staple in our community right now to be able to kind of get us through some of this COVID. It's got a lot of people out. It's got all these kids out being able to do the things that they're doing now, playing the game that they love. Um, so I, I feel very blessed that I was able to be a part of this and be able to be one small cog in this wheel to be able to help this thing move along. So we're